Hi everyone and welcome to this A1 website analyzer tutorial. In this tutorial I will demonstrate how you can perform custom search throughout your entire website that is quite useful if you for instance want to check you have installed Google Analytics on all your pages. Okay, so first we're going into data collection and I'm just saying okay search custom strings and code and pages and we unlock because there are some predefined patterns here. Google Anal Analytics new and Google Analytics old code. So we see they have both been added now. Okay, we will then back to scan website and we will enter boom 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 Microsys tools and hit start scan. Now I'm not going to perform a full scan here, I'm just going to perform a partial scan because otherwise we would be waiting uh, just a bit too long for a uh, video tutorial. Worth noting that you can adjust the speed here if you want just by setting this slider upwards. Okay I think that will do. We will just stop scan now. Okay now get ready for lots of data but it will not be much of a problem and again I want to point out that you can adjust what columns are visible here. But for now, we will just say, uh, just make sure that uh, we have here page search content. Uh, here we see Google Analytics was found there, there, and you know, actually all pages because if we just for a moment say view data columns and then we only want to see disable all. There, uh, we'll, we'll do it like this product, and now we have an easier view of seeing that Google Analytics is indeed installed on all the real URLs pages, those that have been linked and uh, they have Google Analytics installed. Well, that's it. So uh, thanks for thanks for watching. Um, a1 Website Analyzer is a big program, so it will take some time to learn all the features, but I am going to create many more video tutorials demonstrate, demonstrating each one feature.